Hmm, what's there you got on the Pokédex today? Meowth, when its delicate pride is wounded or when the gold coin on its forehead is dirty, it flies into a hysterical rage. Yeah, that sounds about right. Hmm, who else? Why is person look normal? Uh... Because I encountered one normal. Masquerade. This is oh. Its wings and antenna don't cope well with moisture. After a rain, it faces sunward to dry off. Ironic, given it evolves from a water bug. This is true. And sir. One solid blow from its horns is enough to split apart a large tree. Its greatest rival in Alola is Vikavolt. Interesting. Vika Volt, you say? Remember that name for later. Sandy Ghast. It takes control of anyone who puts a hand in its mouth, and so it adds to the accumulation of its sand mound body. I will devour life. Pikimoku. These Pokemon line the beaches. The sticky mucus that covers their bodies can be used to soothe some their skin. How convenient! Ooh. Huh. Anything else? This is the last one. Ah. Seen as a symbol of bad luck, it's generally disliked, yet it gives presents, objects that sparkle or shine, to trainers it's close to. Murkrow did nothing wrong. Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Moon. We're in Howley City right now because there's apparently an optional encounter I can do here, thanks to Cal pointing it out to me. Uh, yeah, more than one optional encounter, in fact, uh, that we'll be doing. Yeah, so first of all, let's head over to Elima's house, which, as you know, is the one just to your left here. You didn't know that, did you? No, I didn't, actually. Well, okay, let's go in and raid his place. I think there's some stuff in his yard, too. Hmm. Ah, sure. What's good? Yeah, what's up? He's alright. Also, that Meganium print shirt, though. He's it's loving good. it. He's just living and loving it. Oh, fashion. I think he'll be just fine. Alright, let's look. Uh... Champ. There's a champ in here. I'd like to talk to Champ. Hey, Zygarde. I recently one. got all. I recently got all hundred of those. I finally got perfect cell, but Jesus, it took a while. I bet. I bet too. No oh boy. Knock knock. It's the United States. Holy shit! That dual screen setup, man. <laughs> Dude. Check out this man. There's accolades. I really want a dual monitor setup. Sure. Yeah, he's doing all right. And then drags me to the trainer's school. You have my thanks. Uh, and now you teleport to the trainer's school. Teleport. <laughs> Yeah, it's a pretty good spiel. Uh, I would like to say a boss battle, but uh, yeah, you're kind of going to obliterate this guy. I mean, he upgraded to gum shoes. Looking nice there. However, um, yeah, um, we were we were kind of meant to do this earlier. Um. Uh, I mean, the game never points you here, so I'm not surprised that we all missed it the first time round. However... Yeah, I'm so sorry, Lima. Uh, we should have come here sooner. That was a good effort. You tried. Mm. Hey, 
Hey Smeargle. Oh yeah, Smeargle I've, I've learned has a different move depending on what your starter is. Really? That's uh, interesting. It has a move that's super effective against your star. So that's pretty nice. Uh, but yeah, he got fucked. Sorry, dude. Good effort, good effort. You might have been a challenge uh, a few episodes ago. You could have been a contender! Whoa, slow, that. The way that Ellen looked in that battle seems to linger in your mind. Actually, that would be that's pretty nice of you. I can go for some team biscuits oh, right now. Oh no, I got pop tarts instead. That'll do. All right. Oh. An Everstone. Ah, you're doing a well. You're doing well. It has other effects as well. No. Let's set those no, aside. No wait, for tell now. me about the other effects. No, no, you tell me about these tell effects right now. Tell me the right other now. effects. Right, right, fucking no. Now. I didn't... no. No. Why didn't you tell me about the fact that it allows bred Pokemon to keep their natures? Ah, but that's too advanced for us to know. Ah, so that's one down. Yeah, but yeah, for the record, that's that's what the Neverstone does. Also. Also. Just for those watching who does not know what else Neverstone does. Be enlightened. All right, that's one down. Now I got two more optional fights to go. Now I got to fight Lana. Uh. Uh, so yep, yeah, so you need to go to her house in... Is it Paniola Town, I think? No, it's uh, Coney Coney City, actually. Ah, Coney Coney City. Which is down at the bottom, isn't it? It's the one at the bottom, right? Yep. Coney Coney! There we go. You can also visit uh, Olivia as well if you really wanted to, but she doesn't say much, I think. She just talks about how she's still a Christmas cake. Because that's what she is. Her her lamentable existence. Are you sure she's in Beyonce? Uh, <laughs> so you need to go to that house, the one on the left, I believe, right? I think yes. No, not that one. The other one. Uh, yeah, just down the road there. Yeah, there we go. So you know, I always wondered why in the anime she has two twin sisters. Uh, have you seen that? No. She has like two little sisters that are twins and look exactly like her. That's... You do you, anime. You do you. Yeah, yeah, but I wondered why that was. But if you go in that room over there... Oh. She does in fact have two twin sisters, but they don't look anything like her. Weird. Do 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 do. Uh, okay. If you say what, they won't let you go. What? It's not a moldy battle. Actually, it's a double battle. No, it's a it, it's a dubs. It's not a multi unless I have a partner too. Yeah, stop cheating, little brats. I don't know any better. <laughs> They're just babby. Babby. Yeah, to get in the spent. anime, in the anime, they look exactly like her for whatever reason. Oh, a, a love dusk and a Corsola. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Where have I seen this before? Hmm. Babby Pokemon. For babbies. They are indeed Babby Pokemon for babbies, and they must be destroyed. I will destroy all babbies. Destroy Babby. <laughs> How is Babby unformed? We're about yeah. to find out. Wait, why didn't you break, break the other one? This is why. Oh! Destroyed. Don't oh man, he's, get, he's getting dangerously close to evolving. Dude. Mm. Uh, speaking of dangerously close to evolving. One more for him. I know it evolves level 30. Fire defense! Ah, oh, That'd be cool. So, that'd be cool, but I already, I'm already you know, content with all the moves I have right now, so... What do you have on him? Uh, payback, uh... Bulldoze, high horsepower, and low sweep. Yeah, he can make his own defense anyway, without the need for uh, iron defense. However, in competitive, that'll be baller, because if someone hits you with a physical attack and you use iron defense, that's what, plus three defense immediately? Yeah, that is, I can, see, a... I can see it being really, really useful in competitive. So by that point, you're basically immortal. Also, he just hard counters skill link, because he gets a defense boost for every hit. 
Oh! So if someone hits you with skill link, you're going up five defense stages immediately. So, uh... Rip That's in impressive. peace if anyone tries that against him, because you've basically made him immortal. That's impressive. Now, I just, now, now all he needs is just an ability to self-recover, like lefties or something. Yeah, lefties or something, yeah, like that. Mm-hmm. Anyway, uh, now that we've beaten them so hard, they look like their sister in the anime. Uh, hey! Hey, Ronald, what's good? Sup? So, yeah, I know the anime has a particularly interesting setup with the, with the dynamic, considering that it's no longer the traveling, just there, it's just a school thing. Uh, three boys and three girls are on, on the docket. Uh, Kiawe is there as well, isn't he? Yeah, and Sophocles, of all people. Oh yeah, Sophocles. We saw him in the, uh... Festival Plaza. He's he's the, the emperor Plaza. of the, pl uh, the Festival Plaza. He is also a trial captain. Uh, we'll be seeing him soon. And by soon, I mean he is the next one that we will see. Ooh. Is it true? I Sophocles see. is next. Sophocles is next on the list. We will meet him. Battle. S soon it will to meet the return of the emperor. I mean, he's got a baller name. I mean, wouldn't you like to be called Sophocles? Dude, Sophocles is an <laughs> awesome name. Sure. Uh, you're not gonna teleport us to another area again, are you? Also, yeah, let's go out front. We are in Wouldn't Brooklyn Hill now. We're in Brooklyn <laughs> Hill. Yeah, let's go out front. In Teleport Brooklyn Hill Brooklyn right Brooklyn now. Hill. Dude, she's like... like <laughs> also, yeah, no more fighting indoors. We, we learned this We learned this mistake in the beginning of Black and White. Brewing the yeah. player's house. Give their mother something mm -hmm. extra to do. Heh. <laughs> the feeling is mutual, my dear. Boss battle! Yeah, this one's actually going to be uh, a challenge. Fight me. Alright, so opens with a chin chow, huh? Hey, hey. Uh, How do? Drop a potion to see what you do and scout. There's right, Bubble uh... Beam! Oh, that's not gonna hurt so bad. Thunderwave. Yeah, uh, that's. I've learned the one thing that Mimikyu's disguise cannot repel. Uh, status moves will still function against its disguise. That is rather unfortunate. As will anything. As will the two legendaries of this game's signature moves, and anything with Mold Breaker, Terra Volt, Giga Blaze? Turbo Blaze. Giga Blaze. Terra Blaze. Turbo Blaze. Turbo Blaze. Uh, or any sort of form of that technique. So if your name is uh, Reshiram and Zekrom, then uh, Mimikyu means nothing to you. Only not really, because it's fairy typing, it'll still fuck you up. This is true. <laughs> Unless your name is Reshiram, in which case it'll be neutral damage. Reshiram. But if you're Zekrom, you're Otherwise, white dragon's like... Alright, I'll switch. Yeah, Reshiram's not taking any of that shit. I know how to handle a Tektite. But do you know how to do Octorox and levers too? Clever. Mm. Yeah, a Rakuen is gonna hurt if they get the if it gets those water moves off on you. It doesn't care what type you are. Oh.
And now for Shelda. Shelda! Takes my scalding hot water. Destroy. I wonder if we can get Shelda. Ah, uh, you do get Shelda somewhere. Uh, no, it's that bay. You know that bay in that cave that you didn't know existed near the meadow? Oh, that one. Okay. Also, it's a 1% chance for fish. Only. Well done. Uh, only you can reset by going in and out of the cave, and the bubbling spots will be 10%. Please remember this. Interesting. So, yeah, it, it's nice that they have these optional battles, but they probably could have signposted them a little more. They could have a bit. I, I, I kind of did not know they existed at all. But, I mean, they're, they're still pretty cool. Uh, so we there is also Mallow that we can fight, but she's only available to fight at day, which in Ray's case will be night, which in uh, Ray's case will be in about an hour. So... Yeah. That's weird, it doesn't look to be night right now, though. Uh, it has to be 6pm and onwards. Huh, weird. Uh, day and night cycles are fixed at 6am and 6pm. That is when they uh, officially change. So I guess now we better go take it to Sophocles. Also, hey, fuck, muscle, your muscle band. Yeah. Muscle band, hey, no, that's not bad. That's a pretty good item. Get hype for physicals. Well, the way that Lionel looked in that battle seems to linger in your mind. Hmm. Well, that was a fun home invasion. Alright, uh, let's go take it to uh, good old Sophocles then. We have to go meet Kokui by the bus stop, right? Uh, yeah. Cal, it's daytime now. Uh, weird. Maybe you could try. Uh, try going to Lush Jungle then. Give it all look. Because you might be right, yeah. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's. I've noticed in this game is not one to one with a timing. It's or unless unless my unless my timing is off with my DS, but it shouldn't be. Cause I checked. In fact, let's it's right now. It, it's supposed to be six a.m. and six p.m. It changes, but I don't know. Did it not account for like daylight savings time or something? Oh, no, you're hasn't. about to you're about to change. Yeah, you're yeah. about to become six p.m. You're a cheating fuck, but in eight minutes it should be right. Also, do you know Shantae Four is out? Uh, anyway, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter right now, indeed. However, I am happy that it is. Anyway. You're doing well, Cal. Uh, yeah, so if we go to Lost Jungle, we should be able to find her, and if not, we'll be able to find her in eight minutes. So, uh... <laughs> that's pretty cool. Look how this one I tuned my time on my 3DS. Guess I forgot. Yeah, I hate that it doesn't do it automatically. Mm-hmm. Mm Neither does the Wii U. Maybe the Switch will revolutionize this. This is what I believe. Ah, I've missed Wonder Trading. Are uh, you heading to Lush Jungle? Yeah, it's that one you want. So, uh, let's talk about Charizard. Now, isn't that a good mechanic? I think so. Mm. Mm. It's so good, you're not forced to have a flying type in every single team you build ever. Mm. Well, as I say, uh, HMs have been abolished. So it makes me wonder when the, uh, when the inevitable diamond... Alright, no, she's not here. She's meant to be there. In the middle. Uh, so we got eight minutes to kill, so... Uh... Uh, uh. <laughs> I Indeed. guess we'll I guess we'll do Sophocles then. Sure, he won't take too long. Head up to the uh, mountain. We do have a route full of trainers to go through first, however. Uh, technically two. Actually, yeah, this might take a while. It's fun. Ah, we'll be okay. I mean, daytime lasts for a while. Mhm. Mm I mean, as I say, six hours. Uh, other way. I know what I'm doing. Oh, you have a plan. We gotta fight you oh, now. Oh yeah, you. You never fought this dude. I was running out of steam at that point, last, last recording. 
Uh, did you find Oak here? Yeah, I did. Got my, got my front ball. Indeed. Of which you can only get one. Trabish! I sincerely hope when you get the moon ball you're gonna save it for something. <laughs> oh, Cal. You card, you. You know, what, you know what I've done. Yeah, I do. I do. The gods of luck were on my side that day. Something Sword like ball. that was one in a thousand. Also, wow, you fucked up. Uh, see you later, Trubbish. Alright, maybe not. My turn. What is High Horsepower's precise effect? Uh, it just does a straight hit. That's it. What's its power? 95. Accuracy is also 95. Very strong. And reliable, too. Not bad. Die? Stamina! Man, that really is strong. Oh, I just got a Mud Bray in a Wonder Trade. You've been defeated, old man. Is there anything else here Watch, like... that I didn't check for? Oh, actually, yeah, there might be. Go up. Uh, there's something I missed when I only came back here recently to get Zygarde cells. Uh, up straight to the top, uh, and then head left. Ah, yes, indeed. Get off. Yeah, that, this one uh, eluded me until the post-game. It's X just an X-Speed. Speed. However, yeah, they, they do quite well with the hidden passageways in this game. I'm there's one in uh, of you. There's one in uh, Ula Ula City or whatever that I missed, or Mali City, or whichever one it was. Holy shit, I got a Litwick over one to trade? Those aren't in the Alola decks, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? That's not in the Alola decks. Oh, you. Hello, oh, you. Sure. I mean, I'm gonna keep it, but, I mean, it's a Litwick. Get that so yeah, when I, whenever you, I, I, I'm sure you've noticed this. Um, oh, you need to go get that Ashkin Ninja soon, don't you? Yeah, we're about that time. I should have gone. And all uh... the and all the money items. Uh, yeah, whenever something doesn't appear in the decks, the the tab where it's like Pokedex number just isn't there at all. Huh. So this this Litwick is just like name type OT, whereas normally it would be Pokedex number name type OT. I also have a Dano, which I am not supposed to have. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, someone wonder traded me it. Just like, here, have this Dano. Apparently you can get Dano and Litwick through that uh, QR scan, because if you QR scan enough, rare Pokemon that aren't in the Alola decks will appear. Uh, up to level 50 plus Gen 5 final form starters. Yeah, I caught Embor the other day. Yeah, Embor will just show up, like level 50 something, like, sup. It's like, I'm an Embor. I'm an Embor. I should not be in this game yet. But I am. Here I am. No. Oh man. I can't wait. We've got like 500 new Pokedex entries in the works. Because this game, as you know, uh, doesn't have a national dex yet. Uh, but it will. I believe in come January when they update Pokemon Bank. I can't wait to see what the Ro on Pokedex's uh, opinion on Rotom is. I hear Rotom has an 8-pack, that Rotom was shredded. <laughs> I hear Rotom could one-shot Arceus at minus 6 special attack. I swear, if they don't do something like that for Rotom, they're wasting the opportunity. Mm -hmm. Speaking of wasted opportunity, uh, Solrock and Lunatone are not in the Alola decks. One million they years do not banned. exist in the game yet. One million years banned. <laughs> but there is an NPC who wants... There is an NPC in this game who wants to see a Lunatone in the desert. He asks, can you show me this moon-shaped Pokemon? And to which you answer, no, you fucking idiot. I don't have a fucking Lunatone. They're not in the game. And he's like, oh. Oh. 
That is just so sad. He destroyed so means, his dreams. Uh, so it means in January we'll actually be able to access that event. I believe he, give, I believe he gives you something cool. Uh, not that we would know yet, of course, but... Didn't see you, Mr. <clears throat> but hey, that'll be nice when we, uh... When we get the good shit TM. Hi. Howdy. Uh, by the way, we've wasted enough time that we can probably go back and fight Mallow now. Yeah, it's that time now. Uh, double check? Let's check. Uh... Oh, it's another... I got another Mariani. Ooh. Maybe this one actually has Regenerator. It's this, episode of, this episode of Pokemon Moon is dedicated to Charizard flying. Ah, <laughs> uh, you're going to be doing a lot of that. Take good care of Garstella. Oh, she's not here yet, nope, really? not here. Let me check this. Let me go straight to Cerebi. So what's your, uh, what's your time say on your 3DS? My time says 18.01, should now, anyway. Oh. Yeah. I'll just keep going back and forth until she appears. Yeah, I guess we'll go attack Sophocles after all. Because he doesn't seem to want, uh, because, uh, Mallow doesn't seem to want to show up. Well, okay. Alright, let's have it. Oh, my son. oh shit, never mind. Uh, we're going to the wrong place. We need to go to the top floor of the restaurant in Kony Kony City. Whoops. So, Thanks, uh, about, Cal. That, about that Charizard flying. <laughs> this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Moon is dedicated to Charizard flying. It's because she takes you to Lush Jungle. Oh. That, I, that I thought she was there, but actually, she doesn't start off there. She's, she once again teleports you. So, uh... So how about that Charizard's animation, huh? That, that, that Charizard animation is something uh, that's, a mighty, that's a mighty fine animation. M mighty fine indeed. Mad fine. Hey, it's time for the remix. Do, 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 do. Remix. Do, 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 do. I came here to play with you. I'm here for a battle. Okay. Mallow, can you give me a hand? <laughs> She's not here. Okay. You have one of those? You have one of those? I have two of those! <coughs> Wimpod is a cool guy. The coolest of bugs. <coughs> That's very good. Yes, very good. How's it going? Oh, right. It looked like the uh, Wimpod was talking to you. It's just like, hey, what's good? Wim. Let's do this. It's time for a remix. Remix. Or actually, a boss battle. She's so happy. 
Everyone's pretty happy. All the caps. Like Phantom. Okay. Looks like she hasn't got any friends to trade with. Despair. She's about to know the spare in a second. Hoi! Yeah, that was a. I don't think Phantom has that much even. Not really. I mean, nor does Trevenant for that matter. <clears throat> Faint attack. Man, what a guy. Super potion. How dare you. Obliterated. Only not really. Mm. Phantom use its leech seed. Turned in despair. Turned away in disgust. She no tick. Yeah. Right, this is where I back out. It's been real. Yeah, you, you can't do anything against that thing. That thing's gonna take you to Flavor Town, all right. <laughs> it's time for Bowser. Aha. Uh -huh. Hey, Toad. What's good? Go in my wow, castle. Ow. I can't decide if Shinotic is cute or creepy. Oh, both. Creepy oh, cute, that's a trope, you know. Toad gone wrong. Get in the castle. Oh, Mavo, I'm in another castle! Good night, sweet prince. <laughs> Steeny. Oh, it's you. Steeny. Data dance. So basically, you're, so basically, you're confusing us again. Man, Smogon would not like you. Um, all right. Time to capture a princess. Ah. Uh. Thank you, Mallow, but your Steeny is in another castle. You mad? She's very mad. That's my captain, indeed. Uh -huh. I do. Uh-huh. You got a fair to ask. Wim. <clears throat> uh, the way that Mal looked in that battle seemed to linger in your mind. I don't know if you can get anything if you go back there. You can check. Um, uh, worth a shot, I guess. I'll never know unless you try. But after that, it's a straight shot to uh, Mount Hokulani, I guess. Yeah, this time for the reels, we saw it. We hope you enjoyed the Charizard's flying enemy for the 16th time this episode. Kind regards the management of this Let's Play. <laughs> Mate, I would look at that animation all day long. But why aren't we riding Charizard X? Like, what? Because that time has come and gone now, Cal. What? No. Kalos is now the past. Alola is the future. It can't be. Well, nothing in the right. room. I guess she no longer exists. Shh, shh, shh. He vanished into the ether. Oh yeah, speaking yeah. of Kiawe, you could battle him too, but only in Sun. Yeah, he's in the other room, I think. Oh yeah, heart scale place. Speaking of, we might as well demo this. Now that I have money. Do it. 
So it's the same as uh, Sushi High Roller, but... I'll take the Vegetarian. Take this... No, wait. Oh, shit. There's a certain restaurant later on where you can get, like, people who show up and they will eat with you. Uh, but not yet, though. Really? I yeah, would assume, because it, it looks like the table for four, because I, I, I would assume that yeah, would be a that, perfect opportunity to do that. The one the one in the fourth island, uh, people can show up. Oh. Uh, but we'll demo that when we get there. We're still a ways off before the fourth island. The third island is the biggest and the most stuff happens on it. Give me two heart scales. That is the truth of this world. Right. right, let's uh, actually advance the damn game this time. Well, excuse me. Hey, Cal, you told me to go do these battles, so if I have anyone to blame, it's you. You hear that, people watching this video? If you have anyone to blame for all, all this derailing, it's Cal, so go put all your blame on Cal. Blame. But also, buy games. Um, alright. Blame. <laughs> Wait, this isn't a stream. Anyway, look, that doesn't matter. What matters is everything will be okay. What I should be doing is going to see Kukui to get my freaking lucky egg, but no, plot first. Oh, yeah. Make sure you do it before it's too late. Blue 10. Mm-hmm. What's up? Balls? Balls. <laughs> I see. May I would have gone for Adam and... Uh, uh, anyway, let's find them. A... Eight stuff? Oh, Jesus Christ. They're not very hard to find. Oh yeah, these mechanics. I fucking hate these. Even when you've got a repel, Pokemon will still just drop out of these trees. Yep. Like Fero. Like Fero. It's like, I, I love it when I'm going around with my repels and it's like, no, no, you still have to fight me. And it's like, no, I don't. No, I don't. Yeah, you, uh, yeah, you do. Fero's are really good for grinding speed EVs, though. They are. I know this. They will summon more and more and more. And with, if you have Pokeros in the power item, within seven kills you will have a max speed set. Ooh, that's great. That's pretty great. Uh, if you want attack, you should be going for Trumbeaks on Route 11. But we haven't been there yet. Raticates on this route at night will also contribute. Alright, we got a trainer. Hey. You're not meant to be admiring the fire, you're meant to be stopping it. The fucking firefighter be like, Yeah! I'm gonna fight you! What? Firefighter Alex. Don't, do not quit your day job. Mm. Dragon Chan! <laughs> Holy world, eh? I mean, a uh, pretty good Pokemon for a firefighter. Now we have a perfect time to reference that. Well, the two, technically. Two episodes in the anime where Ash encounters the firefighting team. Led by Captain Aiden and his, and his crew of fucking War Turtle. Okay. Well, you know you're a baller when. Me. Oh. Stop touching me. What happened? Stop touching me. <clears throat> Hello. Oh. 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 There we go. It's 
sweat is slippery. You are the fool. I love how the rain is. Sorry, are in this game. Changes the happier so much. So good. Yeah, they did, not, the, they did that. did not come through at all. The graphics. Yeah, my is not Even though this. They, they kind of look like. Mostly are, are Gen 6. They're really Gen. Wait, what? When did this happen? It looks like big money with the wrong. That's not big money. Am I? 